If you're using uh, an LX200 GPS or other computerized type telescope like mine, you should have within your handset a high precision pointing function or something similar. HPP or high precision pointing, when it's turned on within an LX200 GPS and then you do a go to to get to a target, will cause the scope to first slew to a bright star near the intended target. Once the scope is on the bright star, you can use the handset to center the star on the screen and that's a perfect time to focus. Once you get there, for example, let's say you were going to use M13 as your first target. Once I have M13 centered on the DSI's chip and this live image coming from it, I'll try to find a uh, relatively isolated star and draw a tracking box around it by left clicking on the mouse and just drawing the box. And you'll see that a red box is drawn and a yellow crosshair is inside the box. And if there was a star in here, it would stay on the star. The next step is to click the auto exposure button. When you do this, the button is going to change to the word abort. And the software is going to begin making some internal exposure settings. When it's done, you'll see that auto exposure is back on the button. Since we're shooting a globule cluster, I would recommend that you use uh, somewhere between five and eight seconds for an exposure time. So let's uh, unclick the live box to stop the live update. Increase the exposure time to five seconds, actually in this case, 5.7. Recheck the live box and now the, all of the exposures that come in will be 5.7 second, second exposures.